It literally took this lady around 10 minutes to make a TikTok video, which then went on to generate her $21,706 in under four weeks. The crazy part is she didn't say a single word in this video and the video is less than 15 seconds long. And no, this is not revenue. This is commission. This is profit that goes directly to her. She doesn't have to share with anyone. She doesn't have to pay any employees. She doesn't have to pay for any ads. This is money that she organically made as a TikTok shop affiliate. So in this video, I'm going to show you the proof firstly so you can see for yourself the numbers that I'm talking about and secondly we're going to walk through and deconstruct what she's done so if you are someone that's new on TikTok looking to make your first dollar online as a TikTok shop affiliate which I think is one of the best ways to make money on TikTok for small new creators currently then stick around we're going to do all of that before the end of the video I will link all these resources and tools in the description as well if you're looking to get started for free on TikTok and make your first dollar online all my free resources Sources will be linked in the description including a free course that you can go and check out as well to get you started but yeah let's talk about this crazy crazy case study here so firstly I'm just going to show you here the tool I'm using is called shop plus which is what I use to spy on people see what videos they're making see what's selling the most currently on TikTok shop see who's making the most money see what they're saying in the videos download their scripts what shops are selling the most what products are selling the most in what period as well if you want to check it out again it will be linked in the description but for this particular example um, the product that we are talking about here is these ashwagandha gummies so as you can see they're number two trending currently for today um, in terms of what's selling the most on tiktok shop affiliate specifically in the US because you can see all different regions on this tool but I've filtered it down to the United States of America. So if we take a look at the product detail page here we can see the product we can see that the commission that you get when you sell this product is 20% and the price of the product right there is about $13.20 which is pretty reasonable. Now for this particular case study we're looking at this is the video that we're focusing on right here this video, as you can see, is 15 seconds long. Um, the video was uploaded on the 8th of August 2024, so less than four weeks ago at the time of me creating and uploading this video. She's got 72K followers, but again, that's not huge on TikTok. You're not really that influential. You're not really that important if you've got 70K followers on TikTok. Those are pretty much regular numbers, some people would say. If you've got 70K on Instagram, then yeah, you might be a bit of an influencer, but on TikTok... That's not really, you know, something that you can say I'm a big influencer, so I'm going to create all these numbers and make all this money consistently. But the crazy part is if you're a TikTok shop affiliate creator and you've got 72K followers on an account that's just purely focused on promoting TikTok shop affiliate products, then you are in a pretty good position to be making a decent kind of money if you follow the right steps and do exactly what she did here. Now, in terms of proof around the numbers, um, so we saw here that the product gives 20% commission for every sale. So every person that buys it from your page, um, you get 20% commission off that. So 20% off that basically every time someone buys it. So this tells us here that the revenue that she's generated in this period since she's uploaded the video less than four weeks ago is $108,530 dollars which is absolutely crazy we can see the video didn't even blow up that heavily it only got like 300k views that's the crazy thing about tiktok shop is your video doesn't have to have millions upon millions of views for you to make money you can literally make money off a video that is receiving you know 20 views 30 views as long as someone clicks on that link and purchases that product even if they don't follow you even if they don't like the video you still get to make money and tiktok makes money as well so 300k views, um, 108,530 in total, that's how much she made. But then 20% of that, the commission, is what goes into her pocket, pockets, which is crazy part. Whatever remains goes to TikTok and the shop owner. But she made 20% of that, which comes to $21,706. And the crazy part is this video is still up as well. This video is not going to get taken down. So who knows how much she's going to make in the next two, three, four, or even five weeks or even longer. It's just absolutely insane. Um, 15 second long video. Um, if I play the video here, um, you'll get to see as well that there's literally nothing special at all about it. Um, 
no audio on it as you can see um, and it doesn't play on here for some reason uh, but if we go into her profile here this is her profile um, and this is that video right there that's got 306 um, thousand views so if I click on the video literally you can hear nothing on it she's doing stuff she's sat on a chair um, and she's got some text on the screen she shows the product that she's promoting she sounds like she's trying to say something I don't know maybe something went wrong and the audio didn't come true on the video but there's you know clearly it's not a very high effort video um, it's literally something that will take you 20 30 seconds to create on TikTok and you can generate this type of income and she's got a ton of videos pretty much on all of them she's promoting some kind of product here so that is the video now in terms of looking exactly what she's done so if you're someone new you're just starting out you're wondering what on earth is going on how can i go about taking advantage of this opportunity myself as well now i digress i know tiktok is going through some legal troubles in the u.s I know that, you know, the future of TikTok in the US is a bit in doubt at the moment. I'm not, you know, blind. I'm watching watching the space for that as well. However, even with that being the case, um, one, TikTok is fighting this in court with the US currently, which is outside the scope of this video. So I'm not going to delve into deep, deeply within that. But secondly, you can see creators in the US are still absolutely quietly raking in. There's people that are panicking and jumping off TikTok, but there's also people that are like, I'm going to use this opportunity to make as much money as I can while TikTok is still there. This is an example as I'm showing you right now. So let's look at the steps that she took to make this a reality. So number one, she found out what's currently trending on TikTok shop so what products she could promote to try and make herself some money now there could have been a number of different ways she could have done this but for you the easiest way to do it in my opinion is to use a tool like shop plus there's another one called kalo data that can check out as well which is similar but this for me has been the easiest one to learn and use so far if you go into top sales underneath products this tells you straight away what's been selling the best yes you know one day ago um weekly monthly what's been trending what have people been buying the most so she probably went ahead done some research like this and found out that these are the products that people are buying the most and from here you can make the decision yourself okay which of these do i feel comfortable talking about do i feel comfortable talking about the vitamin d gummies do i feel comfortable talking about the 15 day clans some of these products might resonate with you and some of them might not even if it's, you know, the highest selling product, it might not necessarily be something you want to talk about. Or if it's a car fresh now, you might not have a car to showcase the product on. So for her in this particular case, she talked about the Goli Ashwagandha Vitamin D gummies there. Now, what you also want to look out for when you're choosing a product is the commission rate because the commission determines how much money you're going to make once you promote that product. In this case, it's 20%, which is absolutely spot on. And the product is in double figures price wise as well so you know if this was a one dollar product 20 percent of one dollar is like nothing so you know you need like a lot of sales whereas in this case when it's double figures then at least you know you don't necessarily need to go super crazy viral to make a decent amount of money so i would make sure that you always look for pretty decent commission 10 20 percent and upwards and double figures in price as well double figures commission double figures in price the next thing she did after she saw what was trending is she went and got the product now there's different ways that you can go about doing this you can either go on places like amazon where you can buy exactly that very same product that is trending on tiktok shop and get it on next day delivery um, in this case we can see that it sells for around 13 dollars so you know it's not going to break the bank think about how much she received as a return on investment from that 13 dollars she got twenty one thousand seven hundred and six dollars as a return on investment so you know are you going to cry over 13 13 dollars uh, when you've got that potential um, another way she could have gotten the product is she could have directly contacted the shop and asked for a sample as well which you can do within tiktok shop i've covered this extensively in another product video here on the channel i'll probably link it um, in the description somewhere but you basically just fill out a very very short form it takes you about 10 seconds uh, you ask for the sample to be sent the shop that sells the product then reviews your tiktok page and decides if it's the right page to send you a sample and a sample just means they send you the product for free and um, they don't you know a lot of the time they're not going to ask for it back unless it's like a really really expensive product but i've never come across a story of anyone asking or saying that the shop asked for a product back send you the product and the 
terms of them sending you that product is that you have to create at least one video promoting that product. Um, I think it may, it varies depending on different shops, but it's as simple as, okay, I'm going to send you this. Um, please create a video promoting that product because you make a sale, I'll make a couple of sales and that relationship starts. The more sales you make for the shop, then the more products they're probably going to consider sending you in future as well. And the crazy thing is, once they see that you're getting a lot of traction and people are buying a lot of your products, the shop has control over that commission amount as well. So they can choose to increase that commission. I've made a video in the past here on uh, TikTok Shop Affiliates where a guy made $250,000 in commission, not in sales, because the shop increased the revenue to around 50% because they were making a crazy amount of sales of this one particular product. So the shop said, let's keep this going. Let's encourage the creator. Let me raise their commission. 50% and that was a crazy result from there but I digress so that's how she would have obtained the product either by going directly on Amazon purchasing it on there to get it quickly while the product is still hot or she would have asked for a sample or the third way is she would could have purchased it from TikTok shop directly as well if you can't find the product on Amazon for example you just go on TikTok shop buy it from there and that'll get sent to you in a couple of days which is another way of getting that product again at the end of the day if you weigh the risk you're risking like 10 13 dollars uh, potentially earning a profit of you know a crazy crazy thousands of dollars or worst case scenario if you don't get those many sales it's still a lot of the time it'll be a product if you choose wisely it'll be a product that you would have generally used anyway even if you weren't promoting it as a tiktok shop affiliate for example if i bought this scope and did a couple of videos to try and promote it and i don't make that many sales i still use the cup anyway at home so it's not really a loss so that's something else that you want to keep in mind as well if you are buying and selecting a product think about whether this is something that you're likely to use at home yourself as well then it's just kind of a win-win the next thing she did after she got the product is she went ahead and created that 15 second video that you can see here. Now, guys, it does not take a lot. Um, 50, it's a 15 second video. It's silent. She's sat on the couch. She's got the product in her hand. And the reason why, by the way, she's got the product, you have got to show TikTok that you've got the product in hand. You can't just be promoting stuff without having the product in your video. Otherwise, your video is going to get strikes. It's going to get taken down because it's going against the terms of TikTok. Yes, there is terms and conditions and guidelines of being a TikTok shop affiliate as well, which again is outside the scope of this video. But you've got to make sure that you've got the product in hand, even if you're not technically, you know, even if you're not using the product, even if she's not putting the gummies in her mouth in the video or, you know, doing whatever, as long as she's got the video there and people can see it, she's actually got that in her hand, people are going to have that level of trust with you because they can see that you've at least got the product in your hand, even if they don't see you using it in your video. And if people can see that you've actually got it, it's that much easier for them to actually buy the product as well. And in a sense, you're educating them also. You're showing them how big the product is. You're showing them, you know, relative to your hands, how big the pills are or the gummies or whatever. And they get an idea of the scale and the size of things, you know, the looks, the colors, the feel, all of that they get from you doing that video, which just makes the purchase decision a lot easier for them. The volume, how many gummies are in the pack, et cetera, et cetera. So she created that video. And another key um piece of advice when creating these videos as well and something that she probably could have done is use again a tool like shop plus here where she went and looked at other videos of other people that are already selling that product um, what are they doing in their videos how are they presenting the product are they long videos are they short videos do they talk do they not talk this allows you to spy on other creators and see what they are doing so you can do exactly what works instead of you know independently trying your own video isolated without really following success so went ahead she created the video and then from there the next thing she did obviously is to upload the video as you can see here um, and from there really the final sort of step is she as you can see there's a bunch of different videos here um, she didn't give up she uploaded a bunch of different videos before she eventually hit that number so you might upload your first video and it might not hit um, you might upload your second video, it might get slightly better, third video, fourth video, etc. Even if you have replicated success, it does take some repetition before you finally get that video that will hit. So it's about that consistency. And for some people, it might even be your first video or your second video, especially if you can see that it's a product that is being already working very well. But there's also that level of consistency that you need. And she clearly was consistent, as you can see, and she 
got the numbers that we can see here. So again, crazy, crazy, crazy case study here. $21,706 with a 15 second video um, promoting gummies. Absolutely crazy. But yeah, let me know your thoughts in the comments. Um, again, all resources will be linked in the description, including my free email course that allows you to get started as a TikTok shop affiliate as well. Check out this video if you want to learn more about this subject.